I'll still sleep like a baby knowing I'm not an unreasonable hag like you. <laughs> Vice, what do I do? You turn on your heel yep. and walk away as fast as your legs can carry you, my good lad. Yep. That's it. I have had enough. Instead of belittling me, why don't you get a proper job? Everyone in the neighborhood treats me like dirt, and it's all because of my unemployed slob of a husband. Oh my god. Uh, actually, I have a job now. Wait, you what? You're kidding. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> That's uh? great. Hello everyone and welcome to Kempo Mom's Gaming. I am Kempo Mom. Hello, hello, and we are continuing our playthrough in New Replicant. So let's go. Now I do want to say one thing is that um, uh, the last video that I did, I actually had to clip out um, a section towards the end uh, because of a copyright claim. So I just clipped the the smidgen out. It was something like maybe two minutes. So if you see a skip in that area, I apologize, but they were there was just a copyright claim on that one. So um, the one thing about this game, for some reason, there's a lot of copyright claims on it. So uh, I apologize if some uh, sections do get uh, deleted, but that's just the easy way to get around it. All right, instead of you know, I got tired of putting copyright, you know, um, what do you what do you call it? Um, uh, the copyright, uh, where you can have an exemption. I got, I keep forgetting, but I, you, I kept tired. I was tired of putting those in and I was constantly putting it in. It was just getting boring. So for two minutes of my video, I just decided, you know what? Just clip it. All right. So let's go. So that's what I did. So I, again, I apologize if it seems like it skipped. I might have to do it on this one too. If there's, yeah, what, what they claim was a Kanye music. Uh, when we were reading the music that was in the background, that's what they claimed. I figured that's what was going to happen. I just didn't feel like reading all the stuff, you know? <laughs> it was just ridiculous. All right. So right now we have to go back to Popola. So let's go. We're in the forest of myth, which we, we fixed everybody from their death dream. Not my birthday, dang it. My birthday is until next month. I'm not a June baby, I'm a July baby. So how was the village? Oh, it was truly magnificent. <laughs> there are no words. Really. Oh, Vice, you're so funny. Neat. Let's get back to Popola. She'll yeah. probably want to know what's going on in there. Yeah, probably. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna rock my boar. It's just a lot quicker. Oh, oh, I almost hit the sheep. Oh. Go ahead, go ahead, Kanye, and uh, beat those guys up. I didn't want to hit the sheep. I'm so concerned. But I am, I'm that nice. I just didn't want to hit the sheep. My goodness. All right, let's go. Now I'm actually thinking about growing flowers on this, uh, what do you call it? This um, file and see if I can actually get the dang legendary flower. I'm like getting tired of, I mean, I'm, I've got to grow the, uh, each flower, each color, but I'm thinking about doing that. So I might do that after I record. Just to try to get the gosh darn flower. The death dream certainly is a strange illness. You think? Yeah, it was something all right. 
Even I, with my natural love for words, have no desire to visit that place ever again. <laughs> you guys did well. You've been making a lot of long trips lately. Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? Mm. I'm okay. I can't just sit around all day while Yona's sick, after all. Yeah. If you say so. So, anything I can do for you? Well, I suppose there is one thing I could use a hand with. Have you heard about our plans to repair the canal? The uh -huh. work probably won't happen for a while. But once it's done, we can use the canal for trade and travel and all kinds of useful things. Actually, you want to do that because you're, you'll are you be able to travel to other areas easily. Instead of running. However, we're a bit behind schedule at the moment. Because running just takes too long. If you're willing to help out, I'd really appreciate it. Oh, well, thanks. No problem. What do you need? Great. So, the man I originally asked to help on this project hasn't shown up for work oh, in no. a few days. Oh, I know this part. So I'm laughing. Worried. So, maybe you can head over to Seafront and check up on him? I'm laughing for a reason. Uh, I'm laughing because the storyline's pretty funny. You'll see. I'll mark the location of his house on your map. He always carries a red bag over his shoulder. So, he should be easy enough to find. I know where he is. Okay, let's go. So we're off to seafront. Let's go. Now again, if you could complete this game within 15 hours, uh, you'll get you'll get a trophy. And uh, what I did is I just played it on the easy mode. Right now we're playing on normal. But I played on easy mode and I was able to complete it within I think it's 15 hours. A canal is it fascinating. If we had a ferry, we could put these days See? of endlessly running about behind us. Exactly. Don't you just float everywhere anyway? Yeah, you don't have legs. I am borne aloft by the winds, lad. It takes <laughs> stamina to maintain this height. Oh my gosh. Really? You could at least try to hide the utter dismay. <laughs> oh, Vice, you're so dang funny. I, l I love his rudeness. Okay, I got a couple people I gotta help here. All right, I could do that. Um, when I stop recording, I'll try to do some extra stuff. So it's just easier to do the story. All righty, all righty. Let's go. Okay, that giant um, shade only shows up when it's cloudy. It's not cloudy right now, but there might be some shades up here. Oh, there's some venison. I just need to get some wheat, I think, for uh, Yona's uh, mysterious stew. Okay. We're almost there. Almost there. Here we go. What is she doing? Tanya is always like flipping around or something. I don't know what she's doing. Man, I am starving. A city of this size must have some manner of eatery nearby. Well, we don't need to eat, really. Okay, there he is. See? See the guy with the red bag right there. This is going to be funny, guys. All right. Um, hey, uh... Are you the guy who's supposed to help repair the canal? Popola sent me to... Oh, God, it's over. My life is <laughs> over. <laughs> Look at Chris. My... It's like, great, here we go again. Surely you must realize nothing good can come of being involved <laughs> in this particular endeavor. I love him so much. Easy, Vice. Hey, so are you all right? I would love to... I would love to win a copy of just the book right just to have them up there because i i mean it'd be wonderful if i could actually craft a book like that it's my wife she left home a week ago and hasn't come back i'm so worried i can't even <laughs> focus on my work oh my sweet dumpling where are you oh, that's terrible would you like us to help you look for her really you do that for me why not we're stuck right sure er but do you have any idea where we should start? Hmm. Well, she always used to enjoy drinking at the tavern with her friends. All right, then I guess we'll start with them. Thank you. This means the world to me. 
Oh, and by the way, my wife always carries a red bag, just like mine. If you mention that, it might ring some bells. Yeah. I've met some odd couples in my day, <laughs> but none who felt the need to wander about <laughs> flaunting matching luggage. <laughs> you need to get with the times. Coordinated outfits are all the rage. Okay, I, I want to clarify something with you. I think the only thing that I wore uh, with my ex-husband was uh, we had the same t-shirts. Okay, and this was when we first started dating. Okay, and I, after that, I did not have a coordinate outfit at all. Never did after that. Plus, these bags are We weren't special. even married yet. We bought them for our anniversary. Oh. Uh -huh. But now my sweet dumpling is gone. <laughs> And it's all my fault. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, okay. Just stay calm. We'll go look for her, alright? You sit tight. Alright, so we gotta go to the tavern, which is over I'm here. I'm willing to bet that man knows more about his wife absconding than his life. Absconding! <laughs> it's right here. Oh, God. Vice is like, he's really rude. Alright, so we gotta talk to this lady here. Hey there, I'm a looking for a woman carrying a red bag. Are you now? Interesting. Did something happen to her? She hasn't been home and her husband's worried. Do you know anything about where she might be? <laughs> Trouble in paradise, is it? Oh, those two never change. Anyway, the short answer is no. She hasn't been around here either. Oh, crap. Though come to think of it, she always got on well with the woman over at the tackle shop. Maybe you should try her? I'll do that. Thanks. Hey, what's the rush? You've got a cute face. Why not sit here and join me for a round? Or three. Or three? <laughs> uh, sorry, ma'am, but I'm not old enough to drink. Yeah, he's too young. Look at, look at her, like, enticing a young man. What's this? Okay, tackle shop. That's up here, this lady here. Hey there. Do you know a woman with a red bag by any chance? A red bag? Oh, sure. Although now that I think about it, I haven't seen her in a while. Last time she came around, she mentioned something about leaving town. But I figured it was just idle talk. Leaving town, huh? All right, thanks for your time. All right, so... If she's think... truly left this charming hamlet, finding her may prove most yeah, difficult indeed. Cause... I just hope she hasn't been attacked by shades or anything. Okay, so I think, let me see where we have to go. Search, oh, in the Southern Plains. So we gotta go back in the Southern Plains. Cause I couldn't remember what I was supposed to do, but thank you for putting that up there. All right. I write Kevin on letters every single day. He always uh, worries about me, but I feel fine. Okay, well, thank you. And I haven't gotten one stupid letter, so, you know, on the go, I'm always saving. Yeah, I think we have to go against some shades. Oh, is it cloudy? Yeah. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, great. Something about that shade seems rather odd. There we go. Pick this up. Red bag. Hey, look at this. It is identical to the red satchel carried by the man who sent us on this mad quest. Perhaps it belongs to his spouse. Oh. Uh. Do you think the shades got her? Maybe. I fear it likely, lad. I sense no other activity in the immediate vicinity. We were too late. Oh, rip. This is terrible. What are we supposed to say? However difficult it may be, we've no choice but to tell the man the truth. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna pick that up. Okay, that was well for All right, let's go. We gotta go back. Uh, back and forth, back and forth. We could do like uh, Zelda and just roll there. Uh, 
That's why I was used to doing Zelda. Zelda games are rule. Yes, I am a Zelda fan. I've played breath I've played all the Zelda games so far. Um, I know Skyward Sword is on Switch, but I really hated that game. <laughs> but I'm thinking about getting it just to play it and, and record it because I had it for the Wii. And uh I haven't played my uh, played the Wii in so long. Hey, did you find my sweet dumpling? No, but we found a red bag. <laughs> we didn't, but we got this off a of shade. I handed over the red bag. Oh no, this this is hers. So our fears were correct. <laughs> oh great! God. How could this happen to her? <laughs> <laughs> this is all my fault. Okay, why is it all okay? I'll just ask the man. If I may, my good man. I want to. Yeah, I'd like to ask. In the first place, it's because because I I think we should give him some time to himself, Vice. I just. Honey, I'm home. Good heavens, you're a wreck. What's wrong? <laughs> Yeah, I'm home. Dumpling, you're not dead. <laughs> what in the world are you talking about? Oh, oh, you found my bag. Thank you so much. I can't believe I went and dropped it like that. So she dropped the bag. Oh, this is such a relief. <laughs> <laughs> okay, seriously, what's going on? It's <laughs> I see. So, he found a shade with my bag and assumed I'd been attacked and killed? <laughs> I'm just glad you're safe, Dumpling. But I'm also so sorry. This is all my fault. Oh, if I didn't eat that apple you were saving. Oh, God, I'm such an idiot. Listen, I promise I'll never eat anything of yours again. <laughs> you just promise never to run away from home again, okay? Run away? Have you lost your mind? I just went to visit my parents. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I told you about this. Uh Going to see my family, gone for a week, <laughs> remember? Ugh, are you serious right now? Why don't you ever <laughs> listen to me? Um, Lad, my brilliant <laughs> intuition suggests we should beat a hasty retreat from these two with all speed. Vice. <laughs> uh, should we stick around and listen? I think we should stick around and listen. <laughs> I can't believe you didn't listen to me. And you ate my apple. Ugh, you are the absolute worst. And you ate my apple. Oh, like oh here we go. Perfect angel. You didn't even care enough about our anniversary to hang on to your bag. <laughs> <laughs> you, kid, I'm right about this, yeah? If anyone's wrong here, it's my wife, right? Oh my god, they're dragging us Wait, in. You're asking me? Okay, who's wrong here? The wife who lost the bag or the husband who ate the apple? I'm gonna say the wife who lost the bag, see what happens. She's probably gonna go off on us. Well, an anniversary gift is an important thing. You probably should have taken better care of it. Oh, so I'm the bad guy now. Is this fun for you two? Do you like ganging up on a poor innocent woman? Ooh, you disgust me. What? No, that's not what I meant. Oh, here we go. Besides, it's pretty rich to come after me for an apple when you threw away my entire stamp collection. <laughs> You're damn right I did, and I'd do it again. You are nothing but a hoarding slob. Oh my God. You there. My husband's in the wrong here, isn't he? Okay, here we go. Uh, pardon, but madam, I... Okay, who's the wrong here? The hoarding slob of a husband, the collection tossing wife, or both of them? I say both of them. Because they're both going nuts. Oh, enough. The both of you are at fault. Now apologize to one another and end yep. this ridiculous display. I agree. Good talk for a floating magazine. <laughs> I see you finally agree on something. Yeah. And they're still going out here. They're still going. An hour later. <laughs> Do you not?
not even understand how frustrating this is, you colossal oaf. This is exactly what I hate about you. An hour. Fine, hate me. I'll still sleep like a baby knowing I'm not an unreasonable hag like you. <laughs> Vice, what do I do? You turn on your heel yep. and walk away as fast as your legs can carry you, my good lad. Yep. That's it. I have had enough. Instead of belittling me, why don't you get a proper job? Everyone in the neighborhood treats me like dirt, and it's all because of my unemployed slob of a husband. Oh my god. Uh, actually, I have a job now. Wait, you what? You're kidding. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> That's ah. great. Her mood changed real quick, didn't it? <laughs> well, I sort of wanted it to be a surprise. Oh, you big silly Billy. Oh, God. Well, this calls for a celebration. Come on, I'm going to bake you a nice apple pie. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> That's why I laughed, guys. I have no idea what just transpired, but it has utterly exhausted me. I agree. Well, looks like they made up, so all's well that ends well? Maybe. In the course of all that madness, I have forgotten why we even came here in the first place. So have I. <laughs> oh, heck, the canal. We need to ask him about the canal. Okay, so we got to go back and ask him. I can't thank you enough for all your help. Uh, sure. But listen, we need to talk to you about the canal. All right. That's why you came here in the first place, huh? Well, now that my love life is rolling in clover again, <laughs> rolling I'm clover. Than happy to get going on the canal work. All right. So now we go back. That was exhausting. Yeah, it was. Tell me. It was. It. Anyway, let's go give Popola an update. Yeah, let's give her an update. Yeah, I will. Thanks, dude. You saw watch yourself around the lighthouse, lady. Yeah, I know. Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's go. The couple with the red bags were a strange pair indeed. You're telling me. It boggles the mind to think but that they're the funny. can persist despite such intense squabbling. Oh, there's well, some relationships that work that way. The end, at least. Yep. Maybe the secret to living a happy life is sharing your feelings, even when they're sort of mean and weird. Yeah. If you adopt such a strategy, I may leave for groceries one day and never return. Okay, yeah, there's a big... Uh, I'm not going against him. It's like a one-shot wonder. When you're this low of a level, he'll like... He'll he'll heal you one shot. Okay. Yeah, because it's cloudy. So they show up when it's cloudy. All right. All this running, I know. But that's why I laughed. I that that scene. I remember when I first played it. I laughed so hard. You ate my apple and threw out the stamps. Squalls in our village now. Yeah, I know. All right, so we're almost there. I know all this run is just monotonous. But this is how the story goes. Okay, back to Popola. Back and forth, back and forth. All right. We back up here, back over here. Goodness, it sounds like the canal repairman had quite the problem on his hands. I'm glad everything turned out all right. Thank you so much for your help. Yeah, after an hour of listening to him squabble. Don't mention it. I'm looking forward to seeing how the canal turns out. Yeah. If you need anything else from us, just say the word. All right. Hey, wait. There's the word. Huh? <laughs> I almost forgot. Yona is looking for you. All right. She said she needed something from you. Time to go play Big Brother for a bit, huh? Oh, great. So, thanks, Pobla. All right, so let's go play Big Brother. Go see what our little sister wants. Wee boom. 
All right. And all this running around takes a lot of time in the video. Okay. But honestly, I, I like this game. I've I've loved playing this game. This is like my what? Probably third or fourth playthrough. No, third. So, because I had to play through it uh, once to get the trophy, the speed trophy. Because you get the speed trophy if you complete the story in a certain amount of time. All right, I got 700 gold. Yeah, I'll take it. It's my money. Yeah. All right, let's see what she hey, wants. You're back. Hopala said you needed something? Yeah. A favor, actually. What is it? Um... I can't help if you don't tell me, sis. Okay, I'm gonna say it. Ready? I'm ready, Yona. I need you to help my friend. Friend? Your friend? Yeah. Yep. I have a friend. And we've been writing each other letters. Oh, she's got a pen pal. Seriously? A pen pal? Yeah, yeah, see? Oh, delightful. God, I remember my first pen pal. So who is this friend? She lived in uh, the UK. Um, well... He? It's a guy? And he's sick and in a whole lot of trouble. And I know that you and Vicey are the only ones who can help him. I see. <laughs> Tell me about this guy. He lives in this really big house down south. And he's super nice. And he's my friend. So you have to help him. Please. Please? Yona, listen. Please. Please. Great. Now what do I do? Um. I say I can't say no to her. Fine. I'll see what I can do. You gotta be nice. Thank you. You gotta be nice to her. Because you figure if, if you weren't, it might aggravate her sickness, so. I gotta be nice. Great. Yona's got a boyfriend. <laughs> There's something amiss, lad. Your voice is trembling. No, it isn't. Shut up. <laughs> Uh-oh. Dear Kempa Mom, today was awesome. Popola made me this huge cake. It was really yummy, and everyone in the village has been wishing me a happy birthday. It's it, it's fun. I feel like a princess or something. I don't feel sick at all today. In fact, I almost forgot I had this disease, so maybe you can forget about it, too, and come back home now. Oh, I guess she was supposed to, she was going to send me this letter, but it didn't get, didn't get really sent to me. All right, we're going to save. Okay, let's, uh, we gotta go to meet that person who sent the letter. I know where it is. So you have to go through the south gate. Yay. Da, da, da. All right. Let's go. I'll help, I'll help these guys, like I said, off recording. Probably after I finish this chapter, I'll do some of the helping. Just to, you know, get extra stuff. Okay, let's go. Oh, there's a bunch of shades. Yeah. There's a big shade. All right. Yeah, these little ones. Oh, you little suckers. Look at this. Yeah, take that. It's bad. It was a huge hit on me. I'm going to end up dying. That jerk. See, when it does that back up like that, that's a huge hit. Oh, well, there goes my medicinal herbs. Yeah, oh, right from behind. And then he backs up. Oh my god. Okay, we're we're riding. We're riding. How can these creatures let us dispatch them without complaint? And what would they fall here in this area in the first place? This is hardly what one would call especially. But come on, get on! Uh, right, let's go. Oh, and get right in the middle of some shades. I'm 
dying here. I might have to start. Do oh, there's a big one right there. It's dodge. Hit, hit, dodge. That is not fair. That is not fair at all. You see that? That wasn't fair. That sucker. Where is it? Yeah, take that. Okay. That's why I hate because I'm such a low level. I'm at the up. Oh boy, I forgot about these spiders. There's a fucking shade behind me. Dodge. And they're still hitting me. Okay, I got poison. I'm poisoned. Okay, let me... Uh, I just go poison. <laughs> this one. Okay, let me get some spider stuff. Giant spider silk. Okay. Did we get everything? Where's uh, Tanya? Okay, she's right there. All right. I think we got everything. Oh, my God. Okay. Man, it's dark. Look at this. It just changed to like dark. Okay, who's this guy? Okay, let's go. We have been waiting for you, sirs. Sirs? There's a madam here. <laughs> Please. Or a ma'am. This way. I shouldn't say madam. A ma'am. Come this way. Into this dark, creepy mansion. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Look at it. Like, walk this way. Alright, let's walk this way. There we go. We'll walk this way. He said, walk this way, so that's what I'm doing. Oh my goodness. Two years just to, where are we it's like two years. Oh here? Okay. Alright. Wait here. Wait here. Alright. <laughs> Please wait here. Okay. Waiting's a bitch. Just let me know if any shades show up, okay? No problem. She's. What are you gonna do? Chill? Yeah. Okay, I'm. I'm gonna go this way. Because I'm curious. Okay, if I, I would go this way, but it's blocked. So you wanna go up? This one bit. Yeah. What's the matter, Vice? Scared? Yeah, he's scared. Uh, perhaps. Hmm. Okay. So he's saying <laughs> Vice is all like, I'm scared. Alright. Let's go back, cause Vice wants to go back. He's 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 scaredied. Okay, this this way. And Kanye's gone. Where'd Kanye go? And Kanye's gone. I knew this was a terrible idea. Haunted manners and the like. Oh, why does no one ever listen to me? <laughs> Alright, so we'll go back out. What the heck? 
Someone get me out of here. No, there's nothing here. Spooky, spooky, oh. Look at the pictures. What's this? Picture has changed. Yeah. Let me see if I can go through here. Oh, wow. Can we go through here? Oh. Okay, I got unlocked hidden items. All right. You're gonna die. All right. Um, I got the moon key. <clears throat> okay, let's go. I'm just wandering all over the place. I have no... I mean, I have a clue where to go, but... Something about... Because these are all... Excuse me. These are all like statues of some for some reason. Okay, let's. Bod. Okay, they didn't give me Jack Diddley. All right. Okay, that's darkness. So I'm trying to find the moon. The moon's probably down here. Oops. I hate when they change the scenes like that. I don't know about you, but it drives me nuts. That's the only... Oh, yeah. I got footsteps and blood. There it is. That was the moon key. Okay. Let's go down here. <clears throat> God, there's a spider, of course. That scared me. <laughs> Oh, wow. You're a male. Young. Not even 20. Good guess. Oh, look at that. That must be the young master of the castle. You figured that out from my footsteps? It's not hard, once you know how. Then I suppose I should tell you about my friend Vice. I... I only heard one set of footsteps. Grimoire Vice does not strut about like a common <laughs> man, Mammal. <laughs> but enough of this introductory chatter. Let us hear your tale. Enough. My name is Emil. Emil. I'm the master of this manor. So you're the one who sent the letters? Letters? What are you talking about? Of course you don't know. Such a thing would be far too simple. Oh my gosh, Vice. He is so rude. No, stay back. Huh? I'm sorry. It's my eyes. Anything I look at gets turned to stone. Oh jeez, that so he's the one that did it. That's why I live with this blindfold. What a remarkable skill. I've never heard of such a thing. Wow. Anyway, I suppose my butler might know more about the letters you received. This key here can unlock any door in the manor. So thank you. My assistance. Oh, sure. No, please don't trouble yourself. We can get around on our own. Oh, right. Sure. Well, here's the key then. Well, thank you. The butler's quarters are at the far end of the manor. Let me at least give you a map. 
It's a big Thank place, you. And I don't want you to get lost. Okay, we got the map. And we got the star key. Alright, thank you much, dude. Vice, what should we do about Kaine? Okay, let me see. Alright, so we have to go... All the way down. Okay. That woman is capable enough on her own. Yeah. Jeez. Remind me to never get on your bad side. Okay, this way. Okay, there's a star key. Alright. Um. See if there's. What's that? A butler. Or at least a remarkable likeness of one. Oh, wow. I knew this was a trap. Curse my brilliant intuition. <laughs> Curse my brilliant intuition. Somebody. Anybody. Wow. Somebody, anybody. There's nothing in here. All right. Somebody, anybody. Huh. The woo At least give me some, like... I'm gonna have to, like, buy a bunch of, like, uh, medicinal herbs because... Get in there. Oh! That scared me. Hear that? Ow! Shades! Oh, of course. Oh my god. I'm alright. I'm gonna die. Okay, I got O tier. Oh my god. Alright. I'm, I'm gonna work on some of these words. Um. Okay, that's attack power. Ha ha. Let's see. Poison. Paralyze. Item drop rate. Experience. I probably want experience because that way I could get higher experience. Didn't give me nothing else but shades. Thank you. Ah, oh, there's a spider. Oh, that's light. Okay, I'm just trying to... Okay. Where was I at? I was... Okay, we gotta go this way. This way. I'm trying to look. Oh, boy, it's dark as garbage here. Boy! Blood? Eeeh... Okay, I'm missing a key, a key then. Ow, sorry, I hit the mic. Uh, oh, there it is. There it is, there it is. God, of course. Of course. Oh boy. Hey, at least I'm getting a little bit better and I'm not like dying right right and left. Okay, this must be, there's the butler. Well, is that another one? Yeah. Boy. <laughs> Boy. They're all mechanical. <laughs> it moves. What's going on here? Sir? What is this? Oh, this is my butler. He helps me out around the manor. He's a good man at heart, but a bit inflexible. Almost like a statue. Yes, and I do apologize for that, Master Emil. <laughs> <laughs> I doubt he's even human. We're here because my sister received some letters from this manor. Yeah. Mm, yes, I wrote those letters. Please forgive my impertinence. Yeah, it was him. As you may know, 
Master Emil, deeply pained by his eyes, has shut himself away from the world. He suffers greatly behind that blindfold, and I feel it is my duty to help however I can. I heard tale of the exploits of an emerging hero, and so I sent a letter to you under Master Emil's name. But I received a response from one Miss Yona instead. Mm -hmm. Wait, so Yona's pen pal is you? Yeah. It is, sir. My letters merely requested that you come to the manor. I meant no ill intent. Mm. I believe Yona saw the exchange somewhat yep. differently. Much differently. <laughs> yeah, sounds like she misunderstood the situation. Yep, yep. Regardless, I am quite pleased to see you here. Long have I dreamed of the day we might be able to do something about Master Emil's eyes. I see. Mm. Yes, well, I am afraid we... Uh, or at least this lad beside me is neither hero nor physician, so if you excuse us, <laughs> oh, I... please, we're so close. The cure for Master Emil's condition is located in this very manner. Yeah. Then why don't you just go get it? Alas, the location of the cure has become a den for those abominable shades, and I lack the skill to combat them. Oh boy, that means I gotta do it. I beg of you. Defeat the shades and restore Master Emil's sight. Yeah, you know, while I an die. Impossible task. Why would you ask it of our guests? Uh huh. Well, you've no more time to waste, so. It's okay. So, yeah. We'll do it. <laughs> See here, lad. This is no time to play the hero. People need to look out for each other, Vice. Plus, uh, we have to find company so anyway. Funny. Uh, oh, thousand thank yous. I owe you a debt that can never be repaid. Yeah. Okay, we got the darkness key. Sorry for all the trouble. My butler cares so much for me, but for him to make such outlandish requests. Well, he just cares for you. Okay, so um, there is a save point up there. All right. Okay, I I like to always like to go to the save point. Cause Okay. Let me make sure I'm going the right way. Yeah, down. But hey, at least I can petrify your enemies. Yeah. That's gotta be some help, right? Oh boy, of course. I can't let you do this on your own. So I'll be right here if you need me. Maybe my eyes can be useful for once. There we go, thank you. Yeah. He's actually petrifying them. While I die. God! I'm trying! I can't- I can't dodge. I cannot dodge. I hate the change here. Thank you for petrifying them. There he goes. Thank you. Even though I, I am dying, I don't think I have any recovery. Oh yeah, I do. I have one. All right. Um, where are we going? There. Okay. That I wanted to go save. But look, look at this picture. Hurry. Scary. Oh, of course, shades. Oops, sorry. Thank you. Oh, he's cool. Thank you, Emil. Because it like changes and I can't target uh, something here. Oh, of course, a shade right in front of it. Thank you, Emil. Blade of Treachery. Okay. Let me, um. It's 139. God, it's less.
I'm gonna go back to that one. All right. I just want to go to the save point. And of course. There we go. Oh. Thank you, Emil. Thank you, Emil. All right. This is hardly the oh, he won't let me. <laughs> he won't let me. He's all, this is the time to hardly write letters. Okay, there we go. All right, saving. All right, into the abyss we go. We'll see what happens. Again, you guys read that. I'm not going to do it. This is it. We should find the cure somewhere nearby. Oh, boy. Uh, I do not like anything about this place. Neither do I. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Great. We have spooky books. Uh-oh. I think that's the other book. No, that's a different book. Yeah. This book's kind of like you, Vice. Yeah. Oh, aren't we clever? As if any mere tome could compare to the wonderment that is Grimoire Vice. Petrification is a fearsome power indeed. Oh, gosh. Oh! I'm just trying to... I have no kid, and they're like beating me up. There's no end to this. Yeah, there is. Always is an end. Oh God. Uh, of course, he runs out of magic. Okay, one second. Let me see. No, I have nothing. That. I should have bought some health. Well, what happened? Okay, it has a magic thing around it. Oh no, I can't petrify it. I know I can't do nothing. Uh oh, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Oh, Kanye, come on, we need you. I know I'm getting killed. Texts, not some manual of Whoa! Supposed to deal with such matters. You guys run! I'll hold it off while you escape. Who's this kid? That's Emil. He's the one who runs this. Fuck! This book is a real asshole. <laughs> She's not even listening. She's too busy vomiting filth disguised as language. You guys go. Whoa! This is my fight. I can't ask you to die for me. My, aren't we the bold one? And yet I fear that would be a foolish course oh. of action at this juncture. And besides, we'd never let you do that. Would you all please just shut the hell up? Uh. What? I'm just saying, if you bastards want to have a goddamn civilized discussion on the merits of bravery and sacrifice, we can do it later. Is this your way of encouraging us? Have we truly sunk to motivational speeches from a woman in her undergarments? <laughs> I guess so. Okay, move it, move it, move it. 
I don't want to. Oh, I don't want to get hit. Okay, move. He tried. He tried. Now. There we go. He tried. He tried. He was gonna run right over me. Well, buy book. I don't know what the heck that book was. Huh. Vice, this is it. Research report on petrification. Well, well. Well, well. Okay, I got a dark whirlwind magic. Okay. Oh no. This passage is written in some kind of code. We went through all this trouble to find it. And now, oh look, Jeeves is back. Jeeves. <laughs> I'm sorry. That... Please allow Jeeves. me to handle this, Master Emil. I shall put all of my efforts into deconstructing this cipher. No matter how long it takes, I will not fail. Okay, Sebastian. cool. Sebastian. Ah, so the servant has a name after all. <laughs> Jeeps. Oh my god, Kanye is just... She's funny. She's, she's as funny as, as Vice. Emil, listen to me. What is it, Kaine? Your eyes are not a sin. Don't ever be ashamed of them. They're a vital part of you. Do you understand? Most likely, I'm probably going to get a copyright claim for this because that's Kanye's uh, theme music. I think I know what she's telling him. Okay, we're out. Kaine. Kaine. All right. I promise I'll never give up, Kaine. But you can't give up either. Well, we're off. All right. Hey, so Yona's sick, and she doesn't get out much. Do you think you might be able to send her more letters when you have the time? Yeah, but the butler Sebastian sent her letters. What's up, you know? I would be delighted, sir. Okay, that's Goodbye, a little wrong. Everyone. Thanks for everything. Take care of me. I hope your eyes get better soon. Okay, sealed verse is collected, so that means we have them all. I saw you exchange some words with that Emil rather earlier. Hopefully it was nothing inappropriate for a young man of his age. Hmm. All right, let me see. Okay, we got to return to Yona. Speak the truth, Hussie. Hussie. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, calm down, Vice. Got our hands on all the sealed verses now. All that remains is to find this Okay, hold on. Um Oh no. Uh That's a magical defensive barrier. Alright. Then we can finally save Yona. 
All right, so we got to go back to Yona. Yeah, it's just I keep getting uh, copyright claims for for that music, so. And all I do is I just put in fair use. So, my last video I had to cut cut the music out. But this, if I get a claim on this one, I'll I'll just put a uh, um, fair use in it. All right, nice picture of the village. Wonderful picture. Was everyone just content? Yeah, that's my house. Okay. Oh, she's getting, she's sick again. You need to lie down. I know. Okay. It won't be much longer, I promise. I finally collected all of the sealed verses. Now, I just need to find Grimoire Noir. It sounds dangerous. Will you be okay? Will you be okay? Of course I will. Is this gonna make me better? Is my cough going to go away? Definitely. Yona? You... You're... You're not gonna hate me because of this. Are you? Uh oh, what'd she what do? You talking about? It's just uh I I don't want you to hate me because of this terrible disease. Yona, I could never hate you. <sighs> I'm gonna go see if Popola has more medicine. Okay, so that means we gotta go see Popola again. Okay, I needed that. 700 gold, I'll take it. All right. Yona's looking weaker and weaker every day. Yes, but do not lose heart. You are the girl's last remaining hope. I'm all the hope she has. Okay, let's go. This is going to be a very long video, guys. Sorry about that, but, you know. All right. Popola, Yona's cough is getting worse. Oh, that's not good. Any chance you could give me some more medicine? Please? The thing is, I actually just ran out. I just ran out. <laughs> I hate to ask this, but can you get me some vapor moss? You'll find it growing near the southern gate. Vapor moss, huh? I'll be right back. All right, I gotta do all this. Yeah, come on. Oy, wee. I gotta do all this. Yep, she feels fine, huh? Sure. I'm fine. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Okay. All right, guys, I'm going to end it there because, you know, I don't want these chapters being too long. Anyway, you know what to do. Hit that like to help me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, hit the subscribe, yeah, subscribe and the bell so you know when I upload. I hope you're enjoying this playthrough. I am, even though I'm still trying to get those that doggone white flower. But anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Bye, all.